Hello guys, uh, this is uh, Windows Vids Alarm Sense. Today we're going to show you my entire Fire Alarm collection. Yes, this is the entire collection. It's pretty small, but it will grow because I'm going to get two new alarms from Mercury. It's going to be either a Firelight BG10 or a Simplex 2099-9754. Uh, for the remote strobe I chose, and I only chose remote strobes, not horn strobes, because we live in an apartment and we do not want to disrupt the neighbors or disturb them. So I decided to get a remote strobe. I like the Wheelock MT, so I got the wheel either the put on my list, the Wheelock LSM 24 VFR. It's a good one. Okay, first we're gonna start off is my BRK slash first alert 9120B smoke detector. It's gonna say it's the back of it. 9120B. It doesn't have the battery in it, nor these other ones here. See I just push the test button, it would go off if it had the button in. Next we have a honeywell. Rebrand of the Demco, the Honeywell 5140 MPS2, so it just pulls like this, and you resets with the hex key. There's also the MPS1, which is a key reset with the actual key. The inside of it, and here's the back of it. Next we have a Simplex 2904-9331 True Alert Remote Strobe. It came from my school because it wasn't working properly, but I fixed the strobe because of a loose connection, and it's smart sync, so it flashes very fast. Next we have here is two Universal SS901 uh, Cody Electric Detectors, as you can see with the base not open. Next we have a 4098-9788 smoke detector base for the True Alarm. I also got this from both. I got this and the True Alert strobe from them. So that is pretty much it. Um, I will be creating a demonstration board when I get my new fire alarms. So I will connect either if I get any of those alarms or not. Well, that's it. So, bye.